Okay, so let's talk about the next step in the process, which is not that I'm going to share with you how to approach these video creators. But first, I want to share with you how you must stay organized before you start implementing this method. Now, look, when you approach a lot of video creators on a daily basis, it's crucial that you stay organized because if you're not, you might, you know, contact someone maybe twice or even more. And this can be annoying for that person. Okay. So we want to avoid this at all costs. That's why I recommend you to use a spreadsheet. I'm going to zoom in a little bit. Let me quickly show you how, um, what I mean with this spreadsheet here. Now, as you can see, we have a lot of col columns here. We have the video URL column, video title, etc. So I'm going to give you access to this and I recommend you to use it. Okay. Before you even start approaching video creators. Now, first of all, video URL, this is where you want to put the video URL from that video you want to basically use for your, you know, to rent the video description, right? Put it in there. For example, this one here, I just copied the URL and put it in here. The video title, I just copied it. It's basically the same, you know, paste it in here and that's it. The date the video has been published, March 16th, 2018. I put it in here as well. Next, we have the channel name. Now, with the channel name, what I recommend you doing is you can either just copy the name of the video creator or the channel, but I like to just copy the link address because that way, in case the channel name is changing, you still have the right address and you know if you already contacted this person for a particular video or not, okay? So you're not losing track. So you're going to copy that, the link address, and you put it in here. Next is you want to put in here the total views of this video. In this case, 2.3 million. Contact date, when you contacted the person, did the person respond or not? And also, did the person agree for your offer that you're going to give them maybe 10 to 20 bucks so you can rent their video description of this video to put your link in there? And if not, then just, you know, put in an N and that's it. If he, if he did or if she did, then put in a Y and then you move on to the next one. Okay, so that's essentially how I personally stay organized and how I recommend you to, you know, stay organized as well when you use this method. All right, now that's it for this video. I'll see you in the next one again.